I am Dr. Shekhar Sarkar. I am an oncosurgeon and I am the chief of the department of oncology in Manipal Hospital, Goa. Today I am going to speak to you on breast cancer which is one of the burning topics all over India. What is the cause of this breast cancer and what, why there is a rise in One significant important factor in breast cancer is estrogen hormone. Because estrogen hormone is the hormone which gives the characteristics of a female. While testosterone hormone is the hormone which gives the characteristics of male. Now there is continuously uninterrupted estrogen acting on a lady is a significant cause. At least that is what the uh, thesis are there. Suppose you start menses at around 10. Previously we used to have patients which used to come when they have started their menses at around 14. Today it is coming to around 10 or 9 also. 9 years old girl also starts with menses. Now if she doesn't get married and doesn't have a child till the age of 30, that means there is continuous 20 years of estrogen bombarding on her body. Important is the good hormone is progesterone. Now progesterone comes into action only when there is a pregnancy. So if you have a estrogen acting and suddenly in, at the age of maybe 25, 26, there is a good pregnancy occurs, then estrogen level goes down and the progesterone which is a good hormone which maintains the pregnancy comes into action, which is a protective hormone for you. But what is the problem in Goa is Goa our fertility rate is 1.7. That means around 25% of the couples will not have children irrespective they wanted to have or not. So that is also already there are around 20% of the ladies who are in the risk factors. Because not having children also is a risk factor. Because if you don't have children that means there is no pregnancy, there is no lactation which are the preventive factor for a mother. Also for the child, lactation also helps child. But it is important that the mother also is protected from breast cancer if you give a good amount of uh, breastfeeding, minimum of six, 6 months but good is around 2 years. But the problem is that now all ladies are working ladies, it is not practically possible for them to take a long leave. But so they normally tend to do, do it for around 1-2 months and then they want to join and then they start on the outside food. So this is the one which is also important part is in breast cancer. So important is good feeding of the breast feeding is important. Second thing is you must have a child before the age of 30. If you have a child which is after the age of 30, you are increasing your risk of getting breast cancer by around 30%. Second most important factor is now recently has come is obesity. The obesity also is a very significant factor. So you have to keep yourself lean, thin which helps yourself in further reducing the risk. And something more than that is, as usual, we all know that tobacco, alcohol has to be avoided. Breast cancer is a one cancer if you are diagnosed in early stages, like stage one and two. Then you have got almost 80 to 90% of chance of total cure and you can have absolutely normal life. And even chemotherapy now is considered, you know, what is supposed to be the one which prevent the spread of the disease. We have come with some test which we show that you are in a good risk factor, then you need not take the chemotherapy also. If you come in early, we can save your breast. There is no need to remove the full breast. Those older things of concepts of removing full breast is gone now. There is oncoplastic surgery. So even if you remove a partial breast, even that much we can reconstruct you well. So we can give you absolutely normal breast look after the surgery. And better radi radiotherapy is available which will you know, will not give a lot of uh, side effects like blackening of the skin and other things. Good chemotherapy is available, good hormone therapy is available. You must come in time actually. 30 years back patient is to come minimum after around 6 months to 7 months, 8 months. But nowadays they come at around 1 month or 2 months. So stage 1 and 2 is almost like a diabetes. You don't have to worry at all. You have to live with the disease and you don't have to worry. You will have a normal life. If you come in stage 3 and 4, still there is a good chance. In stage 3, it is almost 50% chance that you will be alright and in stage 4, it is less. It is almost like I would say around 20% or God has to be very kind to you. And the best three shots which you want to hear from me to prevent cancer is first one thing is stay away from vices, alcohol, smoke. Then have as much of vegetables as possible. And the third one is exercise and stay away from all tin food, all this junk food and red meat.